Hi guys, welcome to another interesting episode of Viva Barca where we are going to be discussing on Xavi's post-match press conference ahead of the 1-1 draw against Napoli. Very disappointing result for us. We are going to be discussing on what Xavi had to say. Of course, he spoke about Ferran Torres, Dembele and many other things after that match. Then also, we are going to be talking about the match reactions from Gerard Piquet, who also spoke after the 1-1 draw. So guys, as we get right into it, please make sure to subscribe to this channel. If you haven't subscribed, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Give the video a like and make sure to watch it right up to the very end. Barcelona began their UEFA Europa League journey with a 1-1 comeback draw against Serie A title contenders at the Camp Nou. Having entered the knockout playoffs after finishing third in their Champions League group, Barca lacked the sharpness in front of goal in their first game in the secondary continental competition since 2003-2004. Piotr Zelinski put the visitors in front in the first period, but Ferran Torres pulled Barcelona back on level terms in the second half from the penalty spot. However, the Spaniard was guilty of missing several guilt edge chances to win it for Barcelona in the latter stages at Barca as Barca settled for a draw in the first leg. Speaking after the game, manager Javier Hernandez defended the January signing, backing him to get better after squandering a series of chances on the night. He said, Today we have missed a lot, but this is the way forward. Ferran is going to score goals. It's a matter of giving him time and confidence, he exclaimed. Xavi also addressed the fact that Usman Dembele was jailed and whistled at by the fans again on Thursday. However, the manager insisted that the Frenchman will soon turn those whistles to chairs. He said, Dembele is going to turn the whistles into applause, he said. Speaking of the game and the outcome, the Barcelona head coach stated, We do not deserve this bad result. By the way, this game was going, we should have won comfortably. Javi also spoke about the moment leading up to Napoli's goal when striker Victor Osimhen appeared to be in, in an offside position, but Zielinski's effort was allowed to stand. He said, The offside law is weird, but we can't do anything about it. I'm happy with the performance, but not with the result. He said, Barcelona will travel to the Diego Armando Maradona Stadium to clash with Napoli in the second leg next week, Thursday, and we hope to fare better than they did last night. Then, also speaking after the game, senior defender Gerard Piquet lamented over the club's inability to take the chances, insisting that Barcelona could have easily won by many goals on the night. He said, Our sensations are really good. We could have scored three, four, five goals even. They arrived once and scored. The worst thing about today is the result, he said. Addressing the fans who were whistling Usman Dembele during the, the, the game, Piquet said, the people are free to whistle whoever they want, but they have to recognize that it affects the team. I please ask them to express themselves after the match. The former Spanish international insisted that the team can go all the way in the tournament if they keep playing like this. He said, Our match was great. Our determination to come back showed. We played well, but it couldn't be. Playing like this, we can win this competition, PK said. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so. So you always stay up to date with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye-bye.